Hey guys, it's Eric. Uh, I'm doing my second vlog. This week I want to talk about chapter 5, which is uh, a lot based on magazines. And I guess this specifically, I'm going to talk about the magazines I like in the magazine and what, what I think the target audience is to those magazines. Uh, personally, so I'm a college athlete. I've been an athlete my whole life. I played middle school sports, high school sports, since I could read, basically. So... Since a young age, I've been my grandmother subscribed me to um, Sports Illustrated, which is personally my favorite magazine. Uh, Sports Illustrated. I didn't like I didn't like to read like books or anything, so my grandmother thought subscribing me to Sports Illustrated would be something that I would enjoy and would force me to read almost. Uh, Sports Illustrated is a magazine that focuses on. Uh, athletes and sports around the world so it's not just football it's not just basketball it's not just one athlete it focuses on like major major topics major things and all of the sports so to to an athlete like me who loves every sport um sports illustrated is like ideal you know so i get i get sports illustrated every month and um sadly since i'm at school we never changed the billing address for the magazines so they still go to my house back home but when I go home, I usually tend to read them. And if I can't get them all the way read, I try to bring them back to school. Uh, currently, I can't find one. But, you know, so basically, like this past month, February, Feb February's um, Sports Illustrated was about the Super Bowl and football, which is because that happened this past February. And that, I mean, it was an amazing magazine, stories about a bunch of players, you know. But um, I think Sports Illustrated targeted audiences, obviously athletes, um, grown-ups who follow sports, both women and female sports. Um, I think it's target audiences, teenagers. Uh, may, I think more so males, but that may be a little wrong, I guess. Um, but overall, all in all, Sports Illustrated is... A top-notch magazine who's been in business for a while and I think will continue in business. Sports Illustrated also offers their magazines and their articles online. So I think uh, I think I'm going to stay subscribed and hopefully tra change my mailing address so I can continue to read them. But um, other than that, uh, Sports Illustrated is the way to go.